black details, black is almost for outline or dark color. The Femme Jean says started the design and created the design and now Pecor is going to outline. Berlin is significant not only for this course but for some of my other research projects because of the ways that my own critical alliance work significantly converses with black radical intellectual traditions set forth by W.E.B. Du Bois, Reverend Martin Luther King Jr., Angela Davis, and Audre Lorde, all who were influenced significantly by their experiences in Berlin. In 1964, during the Civil Rights Movement, Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King delivered a sermon entitled East or West, God's Children, to 20,000 people at the Wald Buna Stadium in West Berlin before crossing the Berlin Wall border at Checkpoint Charlie to deliver a similar sermon to 2,000 people at Marienkirche in East Berlin. In it, he noted, we are often abused, but we are learning to work together to fulfill our dreams through the political structures of our society. Last but not least, self-defined black lesbian mother warrior poet Audre Lorde spent part of each year of her life in Berlin from 1984 until 1992 when she died and was instrumental in helping to develop Afro-German, especially Afro-German women's communities. I first became interested in building intellectual relationships in Berlin after reading the English language translation of Showing Our Colors, Afro-German Women Speak Out, edited by Katerina Oguntoye, Mai Aim, and Dagmar Schultz. Published in 1986, it was the first collection of writing and visual art published by black women in Germany. Communicating the importance of critical alliance work in the preface, Lord wrote, to successfully battle the many faces of institutionalized racial oppression, we must share the strengths of each other's vision, as well as the weaponries born of particular experience. First, we must recognize each other. I was uh, at a friend's house and I saw a book from Audre Lorde and in the back of the book was um, the ad for showing our colors. And I read the title and I was thinking, wow, it sounds very interesting. I need to get this book. And um, I got it. Um, even it was a present from my sister, yeah. She bought it for me and uh, I started to read and to read and I was so excited and so flashed because everything w what was in the book you know, was, was me. It was like looking in a mirror and finally what I felt or thought was uh, giving a voice to other black uh, women. First of all, just being in Berlin, it is such a, a live city and there's so much going on and there's so much to eat and see and on top of that Heidi just connects with the most amazing creative people who teach you something that you have you had no idea about before so it was an amazing experience and I definitely um, recommend it. One of it. my favorite moments um, is to actually just get acquainted with Dr. Heidi Lewis and feel like a professor was more than just a professor so it was awesome. Um, I really appreciated that we got to explore the city on our own terms a lot and just had like a lot of freedom to do our own thing and um, yeah, that was a really, really fun time. <laughs> yeah, I also just like really enjoyed like, the coursework as well, just like meeting like a lot of different people throughout the city of Berlin, understanding like intersectionalities, um, <clears throat> black identity, kind of like seeing like um, how the Black Power Movement has been like working in Berlin, considering that like it started about like 32 years ago. 
now? Yeah. So it was just like, so it was great. Yeah. Great, great food. Yeah. Lots of great food. Oh, so um, good. <laughs> so good. Yeah. Awesome. Well, first of all, Berlin is an awesome city to visit. It's it's really fun. There's a lot to do. But more importantly, to be staying in a place where there was such an intense history of discrimination and to be learning about the current groups that were being discriminated against and how they intersected was really interesting and incredibly relevant to the course. Uh, I could not recommend it enough. Look at what the Fem Geniuses did today. It's such a beautiful expression of our amazing trip.